What's going on guys? Today we are in the back office. We're gonna be taking a look at the program called iMazing. So this is supposedly a better program to connect your phone to your computer, whether it be on a Mac device or it be on a Windows device. So it's just connecting an iOS device to your computer. Um, let's just be honest, there's not much competition. They have iTunes, but they have iTunes, so that's it. I hate using iTunes and me being a primarily iPhone user, I use it to record videos, which I'm actually using it right now. Uh, a better way to talk to my computer is definitely very helpful. So let's go take a dive into it right now and you guys will join me for the ride. So I'll see you guys over on the desktop. What's going on guys? I'm back here on the desktop. So let's go ahead and check out this iMazing program. So the program is here on my desktop. It's saying, please connect an Apple device but I do not have to because everything can be done over wireless. So once you connect your phone or tablet or iPod, if you still have those, uh, once you connect it once, it'll remember that device. And if it, as long as it is on the same wireless network as your computer that iMazing is running on, it'll do everything over Wi-Fi. So you can view all your photos, your music, videos, everything over wireless. And I'm, I do not even have, you can see right there, loading can take a while via Wi-Fi, connect USB cable to speed the process. Um, so yeah, everything is being done over Wi-Fi. My phone is actually in the other room. Uh, and so it's not even here. It's just on the wireless network and it's already remembered the signal of it and remember which phone it is. Um, so on this screen, you have access to everything of your phone. So you have your files, your camera, your photos, music, videos, ringtones, books, all that stuff, and you can access all of that. Uh, let's see, you guys might see some messages. So it's doing a backup. And huh. So it can do a backup over Wi-Fi. But obviously with the cable it's much faster. Um so I don't currently want to do that yet, but that's what you need to do in order to see your messages. And so you can keep your messages here, uh, say if you have any important conversations, or if you just want to transfer them over to a new phone uh, or a new device, once you upgrade, you can do that as well, just doing the backup, and it'll transfer everything to make the phone seem as if it was never brand new. And so it has all your stuff on it, no worries there. You can see all your Safari bookmarks, everything that you've saved, stuff like that. And so history, bookmarks, reading list, you can have calendars, any important dates, but obviously with everything you need to have a backup. And so I still haven't done that just because this computer that it's on or that it's connected to currently, it's not even plugged in, so I can't even say that. The computer that it's connected to doesn't have that much storage. And so with my phone being a 64 gigabyte, that'll eat up quite a bit of my storage. And so I don't want to do that on this laptop, but I will do it on my desktop. Um, so you have access to everything here. And yeah, honestly, this is just an alternative to iTunes, which just the fact that it does everything wirelessly is kind of cool. I'm pretty sure iTunes has something like that, but you have to go through the iCloud uh, nonsense drive there. And that's honestly just annoying. I'm getting a phone call. Sorry about that, guys. So yeah, that's honestly just annoying. And so this is just a much better way to do it and just the ease of use is quick. I've already been using this for about two to three hours and I already can navigate through the entire file system itself and can already do transfers and just the basic stuff that I need without even having to learn anything at all. And so it's just really simple to use. And that's about it guys. It's definitely pretty nice. Um, and just the fact that it's easier to understand than iTunes and that I don't have to relearn stuff and I can already work out stuff in just a matter of a few hours. That's definitely helpful, especially when I use my phone to do most of the projects that you see on this channel. And so you actually see some of the clips right here and I will show you a demo on that. It will play off this, but the one thing is that it does have to download the video onto your device that you are running this program on. So it'll save it to iMazing's file system that is already pre-made onto your system. Once it has the file copied onto there, then you can see it from this main screen you see here. Just give it a few more seconds. And it is taking a little bit longer because I've already done this before. 
It's taking a little bit longer because it is over Wi-Fi before I had it plugged in, but just the fact that you can do it over Wi-Fi and copy it over Wi-Fi, and there it opens up, and you guys will see a clip of the next video that I'm working on for this channel. And so, you can see it's having a little bit of trouble there. But essentially, yeah, you can do everything without a cable, which is definitely kind of cool. It is slower, so cable, definitely recommended, but don't have to, so if it's another room, you can definitely do that. Just have your laptop around, so if you're just in the house, and same Wi-Fi, you're good to go there. And so the Wi-Fi is just your cable, and so that's definitely amazing. That's about it, guys. So it's just an alternative to iTunes, which is definitely a lot nicer and a lot easier to use. So if you guys would like to see, or if you guys would like to buy this product, I will leave a link down in the description below. And please leave a like and subscribe on this video if you guys would like to. So I will see you guys in the next one, and have a great time, guys.